Hey guys, Geekos Tech here, and today I will be making an iPhone SDK tutorial on how, how, how to add a background onto your app. So, first of all, what you want to do is find your background. I uh, use uh, interfacelift.com a lot, and uh, here it is, interfacelift.com. I'll have the link in the description if you're interested. But this site, it's amazing. These people take pictures and they do amazing photo editing, like right here the one I'm actually using on my background if I scroll down is this one I'm actually using that for my background but um so yeah they, they have pages and pages and pages after pages of just amazing um, Photoshop backgrounds and some of the first well were not as good as their you know last but they have gotten a lot better at Photoshop um, they they're just amazing so anyway um and they also have a backdrops application right here I'll be reviewing that um in one of my app reviews but anyway let's just say you want to choose uh this one scroll down and find the one that says mobile then it should say 320 by 480 iPhone just click on it hit download then it should come up with a picture a really high quality pretty amazing so once you got your picture simply drag it to your desktop then you can quit your internet browser okay now is uh, when we open Xcode so hit Xcode and when it loads hit file or go to file and then new project when it loads okay so file new project we're going to want to choose a view based application choose um i'll just call it background save and as you can see it uh was right there and sometimes i have had problems with this um when um you open xcode or whatever i'm not sure if it's just me or it's other people too when you open xcode it says they can't find the background dot app file just hit build a go and then it'll find it Currently, it's loading. I'm not sure why it's taking so long. Because I don't have anything in my app. But anyway, yeah, so just make it build and go. It's not going to show anything, just a gray background with a navigation bar. And it should load. There you go. Gray background with navigation bar. Then you can quit the iPhone simulator, and as you can see, it found the dot app. So, um,. You're gonna want to go to nibfile mainview.xib. But before you do anything in any of this, we are gonna want to drag your background into the backgrounds folder. So, background, you're gonna want to um, right click, add existing file then you're going to choose it and as you can see it's that hit add add and we're done so now we want to go back to the um, interface folder and drag a view view, uh, view not a web view image view, image view here we go simply paste it on top and there you go then you're going to go to the image view attributes select your image there you go you got your background now if you have buttons I'll just show you this real quick let's find a button and I'm put it right there uh, name oops did something wrong there okay I have no idea why it did that but alright so let's go back to image let's import another image view image view and place it in the right spot image 
two streamers. There we go. Uh, I did some wrong there. I have to figure out what it was. But um, okay. So uh, okay. Now, if you have like a button or something else, you're gonna want to, and you want this to be in the back. Just go to layout, layout. Click on the image. So make sure it's clicked. It still doesn't give me an option. But um, you can choose send to front, send to back, send forward, or send backward. Uh, just send it back. It's the easiest way. So uh, there we go. You have a background on your application. Um, save, quit, and build and go. Oh. I'm going to write so that here. But it's opening, and there we go. We have my. Um, background here and uh, you if you want that to be clear you could just select the clear here I'll show you that real quick quit that and go back to main view dot xib or you know what? I'll show you how to change the navigation bar in another iPhone SDK tutorial because uh, I'm running low on battery right now Let's see low on battery so yeah it was pretty good Pretty simple Xcode tutorial, no coding, just some things in Interface Builder. But yeah, thanks for watching. That's how to add an app, add a background to your application, and um, see you in our next review. So, bye.